tag off for me too. We love leave tags on everything. Oh yeah. <laughs> well, I just want people to know where we got it. Try to supply, right? Mm-hmm. Also, I want people to know how much I paid for stuff. <laughs> Nineteen ninety-nine, buddy. Okay, y'all. What we're gonna do is transfer this over into this hanger we got here. What we're gonna do is give this a little time. I'm sorry. <laughs> that was almost like a little. <laughs> this something has happened here. <laughs> I don't know, y'all. I don't know what happened. We're not what, sure. What kind of flowers were the white? You know what? From now on, we are gonna look at our tags because the tags tell you how to take care of it. But no, I'm telling y'all something. I believe if we just let this one stay out here for a little bit, I put a little plant food to it, and uh, we, you know, we water them good, give them plenty of sun. Maybe we give these too much sun. The garden is looking good. I put a little bit of uh, plant food on this garden. Mm -hmm. And I'm telling you, I've seen results over the last 30 minutes. Okay. Mama, I have. Yeah. We've seen results. Yeah. 30 minutes ago, I Yo. put plant food on this. I come back out here and I'm ready to harvest. <laughs> plant food, and I harvest a cantaloupe already that's already tagged. That's crazy right there. <laughs> what brand is that, Mama? People need to know about that right there. I'll advertise them right now. Put it in the ground, put plant food, go in the house, eat lunch, come back and get you a cantaloupe, buddy. Oh, the plant food. It was some kind of smart food. Smart something. food. Smart Something's food, where it's You want a productive garden? Do that. It even tags it. <laughs> I'm telling you, I've never seen a garden do that. I didn't even see that the whole time. I was standing there. Yeah, she's just standing there like, yeah. <laughs> For real, the only thing that did get a little bit messed up from all that rain is the cucumber. The thing I told y'all I was most like excited about. Say it again, baby. The only thing we're worried about is a cucumber. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's leaning a little sideways now. It'll be all right. Is it okay? Did yeah. you look at it when you fed it? It's okay? Yeah. Oh yeah, there we go. There you go, now you're looking better, buddy. There we go. You hang on. <laughs> we don't want you to give up the ghost right now. Now what? Mm-hmm, that's better. That's all it took right there, everybody. Check out the zucchini though. I mean, it needs a name like Bob or something. I don't know. I mean, look at it. The squash over here. Yeah, that one's doing very and good. Brother's too. doing the same thing. Some people out there could probably tell us though, and I'm asking a real question here. Is these? Is it normal for these to be this? Still so short. <laughs> so sh so short. Should these be higher? Is what we're asking. Yeah. I we don't, we don't know. I mean, we're asking this not joking. I mean, I mean, we planted those different pepper plants last year, and I can't remember how long it took them to get, you know, bigger. But they got really big. I will say these are. I mean, they're they're greening up. But I mean, I'm worried about this over here. Is this, you know, normal for this thing to be having a big old bell pepper coming on it and it being this high? The size of a bell pepper. I mean. <laughs> What's going on with that? I know last year, the especially the Tabasco pepper plant got extremely high. I mean, it was like oh, taller than you high. All right, y'all, I'm back inside now. We're gonna go ahead and start cooking supper. Tonight we're having meatball sliders. We're gonna make homemade meatballs and a homemade marinara sauce. <laughs> Mm-hmm. So we've got a lot of garlic here and an onion. We're gonna put a little bit of this in the meatball mixture and then the rest of it is gonna stay in the pot and we'll start from there making the marinara sauce. I'm gonna put a little bit of oil in my pot over here and I need to get my apron because I'm already making a mess with just onion. Okay. I'm making it for you. Thank you, buddy. You're welcome. That's your apron. That's it. Did you think daddy really grew a cantaloupe out there? Yeah. <laughs> okay, we're gonna slice up the onion. I have the oil heating up in the pot. The onion is gonna cook for about... 10 minutes. <laughs> not 10, three to four minutes, and then we'll add in the garlic. Then what? Then we'll start making the meatballs. Then what? Then we'll put them in the oven. Then what? Then we'll make the marinara sauce. Then what? Then we will toast the slider buns. Oh wait, first we will shred the cheese, then we will toast the slider buns. Shred the cheese. Okay. <laughs> yep, you can be the cheese shredder. Cheese shredder. I think one onion will be enough. I started to do two, but I think one will be enough. Everybody, this is gonna be some good eating tonight. Thought we were fixing to get another thunderstorm earlier, but thankfully those clouds passed on by. Okay, you want to 
The meatball slider's coming your way. No, I don't think I'm gonna do the meatballs. I think I'm gonna. Oh, you wanna do the sauce? I'm you wanna supervise the sauce. the sauce, Uncle Edward? I'm doing the sauce, everybody. Okay, so if you're gonna do the sauce, I'm just gonna take a little bit of this um, garlic and onion out, and then you can go ahead and start with the sauce. You tell me how to do the sauce. Okay. I, I had a little thing happen right there. My lips were stuck together when I started that sentence. You used your teeth yesterday, Daddy. <laughs> Only yesterday. Start using my teeth. Okay, so for the meatballs, I'm just getting about this much of the garlic and onions. It's just about a quarter cup there. Maybe just a little bit more. Just a little more. For the meatballs? Yeah, that's for the meatballs. This is where you're going to start the sauce. Right? Sauce. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. You need crushed tomatoes. We have three cans. We're going to start with two. If we need that third one, we'll add it in. All right, everybody. Here we go. For the meatballs, I'm using ground beef and ground pork. Ground we'll pork. have this recipe down below for y'all. This is going to be a really good uh, meatball slider recipe that you're definitely going to want to add to your probably monthly rotation. You want me to go ahead and put these in? You can go ahead. Sure. I'm going to go ahead and put these in, everybody. Here we go. I am doing the sauce for you tonight. You know what they need to make easier to open? Salt containers. That needs to be easier to open. Put in our paste, tomato paste. Crushed tomatoes, here we go. And I'm going back in with another can. And these are actually 28 ounces of crushed tomatoes. All right, now, I got a little tomato paste on me and tomatoes crushed all over me too. Okie dokie, now we're gonna turn this thing up just a little bit. Go ahead and commit to stirring this thing around and about. Now I'm going ahead and put some oregano, fresh oregano, everybody. This is fresh. I'm putting in a good little fistful, if I'd have tell you anything. <laughs> Just put it right down in there, just like that. Now, while you're there, you might just put a little bit more, and then we're gonna go ahead and put us some salt and pepper. Shake that pepper right down in there. I'm gonna go on in with the salt, everybody. Here we go, just shaking it in. Now we're gonna go ahead and start stirring. Okay, I'm gonna get the big baking sheet. I've got the meatball mixture ready to go. Okay, everybody, I took a little sample of that. I can tell I need just a little bit more salt and a little bit more pepper. And right, everybody, I'm gonna turn this down a little bit because it's starting to do a little stuff there. Tell me this, are we wanting one meatball per slider or two? Probably two, baby. Okay, then I'll do them a little bit smaller. Put oregano to taste. What that means is, put what you like, how you want it to taste. Yeah, just taste as you go. Taste With the sauce, you not the meatballs. Right, don't, don't eat raw meatballs. <laughs> we're, not, we're not telling anybody out there to eat raw meatballs. <laughs> what I'm gonna do, everybody, is I'm putting just a little bit more salt. Not much, I'm doing it a little bit at a time. We fix it, put in just a little bit of sugar. Just not a bad. little bit, not much. Yeah. Whoa. Sorry about that, I almost closed the door in your face. That would've been rude. I'm feeling like tomorrow night we'll have spaghetti and meatballs for supper. Cause um, what about that? I've made way too many meatballs. <laughs> There's a perfect sauce right there. Perfect. Absolutely, that's it delicious. smells good. It's really good too. Yeah. That the bottom right now? Yeah, and the other way. The other way. I've never learned how to put them in. Every pan I put in, she's like, turn it that way. Yeah, he puts it in there. He puts it in like this. Just instead like at of night. Like this. Everybody, this is all fixing to come out. It was going to come out anyway. It's coming out now. We both have the same kind of pillow. I don't know the difference in each one of them. For some reason, she does. Yeah, and if I get hers, then I'm laying there fixing to just about doze off. And she's like, "You got? I'm sorry to tell you, you got my pillow." And I'm like, "Sure enough." He squeezes the pillows flat. And so his pillow is much flatter than my pillow. I dream about cow catching at night time, so I'm always squeezing my pillow. I'm like, I got him, boys. Yeah. Got him. We have three different types of cheeses. Stay tuned for that's that. That's gonna be delicious. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. And now a word from our sponsors. Right. Just kidding, we don't have any. Hold on, we got one. Are you tired of drinking the tea that you're drinking? <laughs> Do you set up at night mad because you didn't get the right taste in your tea? Get some Lipton. No, it's not Lipton. Hold on. Louisiana. That's the wrong one. Get you some Louisiana. No, not Louisiana. He always says that. Louisiana. 1902 is the number uh, that you want to type in for your code, and you will not get anything <laughs> off. But I will tell you that Louisiana, Louisiana, I'll get it right in a minute, is the best tea on the planet.
What about that? Mm. 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 That's all I can say. <laughs> That's delicious.